Aerith, you sure about this? If you've got any better ideas. Not really. So that's the way it is. Hmm. Tifa's been invited into the Don's estate. Huh? But to earn such a privilege, you must first win the approval of one of the trio. Right? Meaning, I now know what I must do to save her. Stay strong, Tifa! Help is on the way! Johnny's coming, baby! <laughs> Not the sharpest tool in the shed, is he? Nope. I'll tell you a thousand times. Oh, got nothing God. for you. Now scram. Wait, here's out. You're one of the trio, right? I want you to get me into the audition. Huh? Pretty please? Why not? Really? Sure. Next time an audition comes around, I'll put your name in the hat. Next time will be too late. Can't you get me into this one? You want in now? No can do, sweetheart. Hardy recommended Tifa, and she's got this in the bag. How can you be so sure Corneo will pick Tifa? You never know, he might pick me. Damn, you really do want in, don't you? Sure do. Then how's about we play for it? Call it, Missy. Heads or tails? Guess right, and I'll grant you your wish. <sighs> Guess wrong, and you'll leave me in peace. No thanks. Oh, not a gambler, huh? I am! Heads! Huh? Hmm? Hmm. so glum. You're a pretty enough gal. Just not quite Corneo's cup of tea. But if only the Don will do, try convincing one of the other two. That's why it's a trio, not just the Mio. Now skedaddle. Wait. Mind if I see that coin of yours? Coin. I had a hunch. That's cheating! And that's the wall market way. Lesson learned. Still cheating. They're closed right now? I feel rejuvenated and alive. It's like I've got a brand new body. See the sign out front? All I got is materia. Thanks, buddy. Right. There's 
something downright wrong with this place. Oh, this place is full up too. This the place I have to be able to go down like this. Think so. Uh, just wanted to Let me see handle Andrea. this. Curse we wait out here. We okay. And why would I do that? No, I'm coming with. I'm not really sure that. You're a man of many talents, but talking isn't one of them. I mean, shit. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> Good evening. Oh. Hey. Uh. Welcome to the heart and soul of Wall Market, the Honey Bee Inn. Is there a honey boy or girl whose company you desire? Uh, we're here to see Andrea Rodea. Ah, the shining star of the Honey Bee Inn. Now, are you the one who made the appointment, sir? Can I have your name? Oh, we don't have an appointment. I see. I'm terribly sorry, sir. An appointment is required, and the earliest available slot is three years from now. Three years?! All we want is five minutes. He can spare that. I need his help for the Corneo audition. Yes. Well, regardless of the circumstances, you cannot meet him without an appointment. Is there really no other way? It is rare, but Mr. Rodea does occasionally extend invitations to individuals who catch his eye. Otherwise, I'm sorry, but there really is nothing that can be done. I guess that's that then. Oh well. Let's try someone else. You bet I am! This is the first time in my life sitting... I'm sorry that I couldn't be of more help to you. A year to save up for this! Wow! I hope you enjoy the show. I know why you're here. Huh? Wait, you're just here for the girls, aren't you? This place is absolute chaos. It's amazing. But I don't like that on the place. Marlita's the greatest honey girl there ever was. It's an undisputed truth, and I dare anyone try and deny it. I dare. You are wrong, sir. Folia may be new, but she is clearly the best, and the only one worthy of being called the greatest. I'm so excited! Johnny's been had. She's a siren, I tell you. My girl. This must be the place. Welcome, welcome. Just the two of you? Step right up. Now then, what manner of massage do you desire? Say what? Is this your first time in our establishment? Mm hmm We are a hand massage parlor. An excess of fatigue and tension can make even the simplest task a terrible strain. It is our pleasure to relieve our patrons of that tension. <laughs> and what better way to seek relief than through the skilled ministrations of a professional? So now that we understand each other, what manner of massage do you desire? We're not customers. 
than you are. Hoping you can help us get an invite to an audition with oh, Don Cook. Love of Say another word and I'll shove this fan right down your throat. Oh. Oh. Ugh, this is the last thing I need. You're young and stupid, and I suppose that means you think I'll let you off easy. So, you want what? A favor? Well, here's the thing. This is a massage parlor, a respectable establishment. But if you don't require our services, then tell me! Is there any reason I shouldn't have you dragged outside and shot for wasting my valuable time? Well? Hmm. Name? Cloud Strife. Hand. Huh? Give it to me! The strong, firm hands of a fighter, yet they possess a certain elegance and grace. Okay, Cloud, let's see what you're made of. After that, we'll talk. So, which course will it be? <laughs> then make your way to the room in the back and wait. Cloud? <laughs> this exclusive treatment is reserved for our most well-to-do patrons. First, the hand cream. A generous coating for each and every one of your richly deserving fingers. Let's start with the tips. That's it. Relax. I'm only here to help. Oh, did that hurt? No. <laughs> then I'll move on to the base of the fingers. Let's see if we can't improve your circulation and get that blood flowing. No, don't fight it. Stress is poison to the body. And finally, some gentle stimulation for the palm. No more than a touch. Just like this. Oh, what was that? A cry of pleasure? Is this how you like it? How about this? Or maybe this? <laughs> If that was to your liking, do come again. Right. How was it? Huh? Are you okay? Yeah. You're acting weird, Cloud. I am? Really weird. Hmm. Think you'll make a habit of it? All right then. I think I've seen everything I need to see. So? Tell me what you want, and we'll take it from there. Trio, right? I want to get into Corneo's next audition. And why in the world would you want to do that? Hmm. Okay. Really? But you cannot go dressed like that. Huh? I could never send Corneo a candidate wearing such a plain looking getup. Doing so would call my position as one of the trio into question. Is something wrong with my outfit?
matter what I think? Well, I think it's pretty cool. Look, just take it outside the parlor, would you? Sorry, we'll stop. So, what should I do about the outfit? <laughs> you just leave that to me. I'll put you in a dress so fabulous, you'll look like a million gill. So long as you can afford it. How much? What I said. But don't worry. It's obvious you can't afford a dress with that kind of price tag. So listen, I have an idea. Uh. There's an underground coliseum in this town. Up for a fight, Cloud? Good. Because I'm getting you into that arena. If you win the tournament, I'll transform Aerith into a drop-dead gorgeous beauty. Is there any prize money? <laughs> yes, for the person who got you in. So, what do you say? All right. That's what I like to hear. You'll need this. They're already letting fighters inside. You should hurry. Run along. What have we gotten ourselves into? Nothing good. I wouldn't expect a fair fight in this town. Think we can win it all? That's one thing I'm definitely sure of. I appreciate the confidence, just don't get too cocky, okay? this you're here to compete <laughs> I hope you know you're cutting it really close so the two of you are a team team no it's just me yes the two of us are a team I need to get into that audition but I won't let anyone else fight my battles for me that includes you mister all right team it is head to the waiting area down below are fighting. Hey, you're not nervous, are you? Nope. Really? You're even more quiet than usual. Just trying to focus, like you should. Hey! Lovebirds! Over here! In the city that never sleeps, in the paradise of debauchery and sin, the pain and pleasure, where your every desire can be indulged for the right price. All for you as Dean Connoisseur of Chaos and Bloodshed, we bid you the warmest of welcomes. Are you sitting comfortably? For tonight, the most gruesome spectacle anywhere in Walmart or beyond shall be yours to witness here in the Corneo Coliseum! Tonight's grand prize is no less than one million gold, and there's only one way to get it. Brutalize your opponents, thoroughly and utterly, viciously, without mercy, until they vomit blood. Only the most ruthless fighters, the savages still standing here at the end, shall claim the skill and the glory. And now, the long-awaited event in which the blood star feet will battle for your amusement, and the bonus! Warriors of every shape and size will fight to the death before your very eyes in tonight's Corneo Time! Wow, this place is really something. You two, wait here until it's time. <laughs> Oh, you again. 
Ouch, what happened to your face? I just needed a little scratch, you know? So I signed up for the preliminaries and, well, I hope you guys realize what you're getting into. I don't want to scare you, but if you can make a run for it, you should. Cloud and Aerith, your match will begin shortly. Please make your way to the gate. We're in way too deep to back out now. You two ready? Try not to get yourselves killed. For our next batch, we welcome two fighters, a young couple no less. Talking about a bad day? This is their first tournament, the bad first date, and most likely their last, inexperienced as they are. Or are they? Give it up for Cloud and Eric! <laughs> One of Walmart's own, a renowned master of beasts. Will his pets make a meal of our two challengers before our very eyes? They've already been given their appetizers. Their hunger for flesh and fear is unquenchable. The demon talks of hell. The sanguine stalkers! <laughs> You got animals? Oh, first timers, huh? There's no rule that says you gotta fight man to man. We are in for a treat, ladies and gentlemen. Who will prevail in this brutal contest between man and beast? This could be over in an instant, so don't even blink. Without further ado, the fourth match of the first round begins now! Get him! <laughs> On you. So it's my turn? Maybe this will help? Watch this. Sorry. I don't think anyone saw this coming! 
What a completely unexpected turn of events! And the winners of our match are Cloud and Eren! Well, that's one win down. Go team! What's wrong? The rules don't make sense. Yeah, true. But maybe it'll be better in the next match? Nah. Wouldn't bet on it. Better to expect the worst. Cloud and Aerith, your match will begin shortly. Please make your way to the gate. That's what they call beginner's luck. But the next match won't be so easy. Ready to rock? Just remember, try not to die. For the second match in our spectacular semi-finals! Fresh from their first date with death, I present the Lucky Couple! We're like unlucky for the rest of us! Give it up once again for Cloud and Aerith! Couple of my ass! What the hell you two try to fall? You assholes cost me a fortune! Yeah, yeah! They're hurting screamers in this trap job! Thieves and killers through and through! Two criminal for common criminals, the worst of the worst! Ladies and gentlemen, check your pockets, because they may have already robbed your blind! The most contemptible son of bitches in town of war market, Vex of the Corneo Cup semi-finals. Begin oh, now! Take the lead. Here goes. Cut! <laughs> One more shot! And here going. Whatever. 
So it's my turn? That'll do! That was Hang back. I won't give up. Why can't I? Push it. I got you. That's it. did give him a massage, you know. His palm told quite the tale. He's cheated death more than a few times. Hmm. So have half the people in this town. Anyway, we're both still alive. Call it. <sighs> there you go again. One of these days, your luck is going to run out. When I fall from grace, Maybe I'll land in your parlor once more. <clears throat> that is one mistake I will never repeat. <laughs> you gotta admit, Andy, the way he moves is totally amazing! Andy! Hmm. <sighs> Next up, the big finale. Yeah. I thought you'd be happier. Just thinking about what we might face next. But you know, we've made it this far. I'm sure we can handle anything they throw at us. Cloud and Aerith, the final match will begin shortly. Please make your way to the gate. Not bad, not bad. You better make sure you rest up nice and good. Does this mean I don't gossip like dead no more? Does this mean I don't gossip like dead no more? Damn, you two are really something else. I could use that kind of muscle in my game. Damn, you two are really something else. I could use that kind of muscle in my game. So hungry. So hungry. Man, you proved me wrong. You guys are pretty good. It's the final match. You good to go? I've got a lot of money riding on you two. Win it for me. Ladies and gentlemen, our time together is almost over. Tonight's thrilling Corneo Cup, filled with unprecedented upsets and drama, has only one match to go. 
<laughs> we know. We're just as disappointed as you are. But ladies and gentlemen, all good things must come to an end. So let's celebrate by getting so damn loud, they'll hear us up on the plane! Yeah! Come on! Once more, the sweethearts who surprise us with upset after spectacular upset. The power couple with the boundless love for bloodshed. The champions of Madam M, Cloud, and Eric! Executioners, Chocobo Sam's champions, Cuddy and Sleepy! Come on! Robots? More like Shimmer armor. More like cheating! <sighs> Who will walk away with the one million kill prize? Get ready for a fight guaranteed to go down in history! The final match of the Corneo Cup begins now! Keep it together. So it's my turn? Taking this rather well. I was looking forward to a little temper tantrum. When you bet it all on a toss, sometimes you get burned by Lady Luck. Every coin has two sides. 
You're right, of course. Even if they are both the same. Later. And now, I believe I have a prize to collect. Sorry. The madam will have to wait. The Don's demanding that we tack on one more match, it seems. What? If they win out, then you get paid in full. Now hold on just a goddamn minute! His call, not mine. <laughs> now that that's over, we can go save Tifa. So we'll head back to Madam Im's, get you changed, and then it's off to Corneo's. Right. Sorry to be the bearer of bad news, but you still have one fight left. What do you mean? The crowd loved your show a little too much. People are placing hefty bets, much heftier than you can possibly imagine. Corneo's going to milk this for as much as he can. Meaning what? You face and defeat Corneo's fighter of choice, and only then will you be declared winners of the tournament. Hey, that wasn't the deal! Don't you think I know that?! Ah! You greedy bastard! Scum-sucking piece of shit festering asshole! Uh... <sighs> but that's the way it is. Corneo's the one who makes the rules around here. But if you win this match, Corneo will have to accept your victory. And the crowd will make sure he does. So this is the last one? <laughs> I sure hope so.